Hi, thank you guys for coming today. We are conducting research about Fuzzy Taco Shop and brand loyalty between young consumers. My name is Melissa Casey. I'm Mary Gray. I am a Stratcom major and I'll be graduating next spring. Let me see. Stratcom and graduating in the spring. Um, would you guys like to go around and introduce yourself just so we feel a little bit more comfortable? Um, sure. Um, my name is Asa Yonada. I'm a senior studying communications, graduating next spring. Uh, my name is Tom Willer. I am a junior uh, studying strategic communications and I graduate next school year in the spring. <laughs> I am the same thing and my name is Nikki, Nikki Coppers. Sorry. Uh, my name is Crystal. I'm a senior. I will graduate next May or next spring and this spring comes I'm Rebecca. I'm a major as well. Uh, my name is Kevin. I'm a psych major, and I'll graduate in the spring. Okay. <laughs> 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 my name is Caitlin. And I'm a Stratcom major, and I'll graduate in the spring. I'm Julie Haldak, and I graduate in the spring as well. Hopefully. <laughs> okay. um, we're going to be taking notes on what you guys say. Just know that there are no right or wrong answers. Um, we're just taking this for observation. Um, we just ask that you guys respect each other with meetings if there's some kind of crazy controversy about loyalty programs. Just be nice to each other if you disagree. <laughs> um, and then anyone can speak. There's not an order of the conversation at all, so feel free. Uh, so our research objective is to, it's this. Fuzzy's Taco Shop is a casual-style restaurant with over 60 locations across the Midwest. We believe that casual dining restaurants such as Fuzzy's Taco Shop have the opportunity to increase its patronage, patronage from young adults through loyalty programs. Our research will discover whether these loyalty programs will increase patronage and whether or not it should be technology driven through such things as iPhones or an app, Android apps to become successful. Yeah. yeah, so basically we just want to talk about loyalty programs. Um, so, but first we want to talk about eating out and um, some of the factors that you guys take into consideration when you go eat out. Uh, I mean, for me, it's probably price like depending mm -hmm. on if I'm feeling it on the average day and then convenience like if, if I'm in a hurry I usually just end up going to Taco Bell or McDonald's mm -hmm. um, if I'm like with a group of people probably like Pseudo Lindos, Fuzzies, um, Jefferson's like if we have a little more time. Mm -hmm. So you're more willing to spend the higher yeah. money when you go out with a group? Yeah with, with a group yeah definitely. Okay and then anybody else like what how much are you guys like? Is it like five dollars too much on a college budget? Is that something that you would rather go with like five to six friends with? Or if you're going to buy McDonald's, are you willing to spend seven to eight dollars? You're going to have a fuzzy by yourself. Like how I feel like spend? everything in Lawrence you can get for like if it's like under ten dollars, it's like reasonable. Like most mm -hmm. places are under ten dollars mm -hmm. if you're like not going crazy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am gluten free, so mm -hmm. that's a huge thing. But I like Chipotle because yeah. I want less than gluten. Okay. It's cheap and do you guys usually prefer to drive through, or do you prefer to sit down? I think it kind of depends on the situation. Yeah. yeah. Solo drive through. If I have time, yeah, solo drive through. If I have time, definitely, and I'm with a group, definitely sit down. Mm -hmm. So I just like drive through and like, mm -hmm. bring it back. But. So say you're, you know, you decide to sit down. What sort of atmosphere are you guys looking for? When, like, when you're in a restaurant, you know, is it is it like a typical night out with friends, or is it like during the week. During the week. Yeah. Think of like going to dinner on a very casual, like you're going to get with your friends. This is not like a weekend meal. Like you're going to be spending less, but you're going to be going for more, more casual, like fuzzies. Do you want like TVs in the background? Like what is something that you guys look for when you, yeah, that's a good place to eat out? Yeah, I feel like a lot of times, like if I'm going out to eat, like it's usually like to watch a sports game or like something. And so I want to go somewhere that I can like have a conversation with my friends but like not be like so loud and I like, can't like pay attention to the game mm -hmm. I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. During the yeah. small season, I think it's like a hot spot. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. like a movie and it comes out the time and down the line. We're prepared to watch some things and keep it or during the daytime time we may like to listen to some music or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Def definitely some place that is a like more relaxed atmosphere. Mm -hmm. Some place where like the waiter isn't going to be coming around every five minutes to check on us. I like, mm -hmm. like just kind of being left alone with yeah. friends. Maybe like like fuzzy where you can like you don't need to ask for a refill. You can go up and just do it yourself. Um, just like 
if you're out of the world. I don't know. Yeah. yeah. No, I would say that's true. Would you would you say that when you eat out during the week, do you typically go like around the dinner hour or the lunch hour? Dinner hour. Dinner hour. Dinner hour. Okay. Is that just because of school or just because it's more convenient and you'd rather eat out? I think it's when everybody's typically yeah. kind of free. Or people are available yeah. to like, yeah, like I won't, I probably just would like go to Fuzzies if like I couldn't have like three or four of my roommates go okay. with me. Right. Yeah. It's something more like a social thing. Like going out to eat on the weekend or during the week, if I'm going to do it, it's going to be like with people. I don't usually, usually like go out and get food. Mm -hmm. How many times a week do you guys think you actually, whether it's fast food or not, or fast food, like casual food, how many times do you guys eat out? Probably four. Yeah. Four <laughs> Definitely Saturday and Sunday for sure. Yeah. And then um, maybe one or two nights on a weekday. Okay. And then what? But like on Facebook, do you guys interact with the brands that you go with? Like for Fuzzy, they have a they have like they list their specials for Lawrence. Is that an in influencer on whether or not you guys? Oh, I just saw the time on Fuzzy's Facebook page. I went to go there. A lot of times they have like. Crazy deals on that. So yeah. to get the, yeah. Sometimes they post coupons. Yeah. yeah. So then, what social media outlets do you use the most to like connect with restaurants? Facebook. 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 Okay. I've also seen people do Twitter for yeah. Chipotle yeah. recently. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They've been doing like buy one get one yeah. things, and yeah. then that gets like someone to text you and be like, yeah, buy one get one, let's mm -hmm. go. Would you say that it's more, you know, Facebook or Twitter instead of like flyers that you see out? You know, you'll respond to something via Facebook or Twitter. Yeah. More yeah. than, you know, a physical piece of paper. And I'm actually right. looking at, like, right. I, exactly. my focus is there, and whereas flyers are just, like, around me, right. they're not my main focus, right. but, like, when I'm on my phone. Like, for example, I think there's a the $5 coupon on the back of um, the football tickets. Yeah. 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 Sure. yeah. Like, if any of you use something like that. I have used that. Okay. Yeah. I have used that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I mean, like, I mean, I might be the one, but I work for the paper, like in advertising, yeah. so like okay. I know like what's going in. But if I didn't, mm -hmm. I would definitely be just like more. Mm -hmm. I feel like Facebook and Twitter is just easier. Yeah. Do yeah. you guys do you guys feel like your friends influence you? Like you know, if, if like they suggest, you know, I saw this. Do you guys kind of collaborate? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Especially that like a more thrifty friend who like actually does is uh -huh. like actively looking at coupon books. So I'll be like, oh yeah, sure, like I'll go get that yeah, if you want to dip with you. Yeah, that's true. Oh, Rebecca, what's your favorite social media outlet? When people go out, do you just kind of suck it up and say, I can't eat anything out, eat something at home? Or like I, mean, I like used to cheat all the time, but I just recently, like this year, said, like, I can't go there. And I mean, people get annoyed with it, but I really don't care. So, I mean, they try to go places, but like Mexican food, a lot of stuff is gluten free. Yeah. So, that's obviously mm -hmm. nice. Okay, so what is your preferred, like, what restaurant do you go to during the week? You're gonna go out for the casual yeah. 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 If you if Fuzzy's had like a rewards card or like a rewards, you know, sort of point system, do you think you guys would go to Fuzzy's more? Yeah. Yeah. When I when I go to Fuzzy's, like they I don't know if this is gonna be a question, but they have the front flip app. Yeah. Right. And I yeah. have yeah. there. Like yeah. I want a free I like ten dollar yeah. dinner yeah. there one time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So before we get to the app, just really quickly, I wanna also wanted to ask, like, if you're doing four score is four square isn't as cool. But would you be more willing like, to check in if that meant that you could get possibly 25% to 50% or something? Or yeah. in addition yeah. to like, the app and things yeah, like that? Like sure. anything social media, you probably will not Especially if it's like super easy while you're in line. Yeah. You can just do it and be like, oh, I see the sign. Anything yeah. that I don't have to do ahead of time. Like, yeah, it's cool if you get a coupon, but it means you have to like, go print it off. Like, no. right. Chance are right. So if you yeah. can just show it on your phone, even if yeah. it's not like an app thing, that's a big deal. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so one of our key questions is, 
how do discount, discounts for like coupons and things like that and apps, how do they affect what, where you choose to eat? I think that we've probably established this, but like, is that really important to you or is that something where yay, you can add a bonus but not super important? Uh, it kind of depends on what my bank accounts me like. Like mm -hmm. if I just got paid, I'll like don't care, but if I like, it's getting towards like the end of the month or something, mm -hmm. or if like I spent way too much that weekend, mm -hmm. I'll start like digging through and looking for, okay. yeah, it just kind of depends. Okay. How, uh, it, also, it also can be like the decider between me like eating Easy Mac or ramen noodles yeah. and like actually like venturing out of the house yeah. right. and getting a meal. <laughs> this is sort of an off topic question that goes along with it, but how many of you have jobs? Okay. So you guys have your own income? Mm -hmm. You know, probably a small, like on campus yeah. income? Yeah. Something like that? Yeah. Okay. So do you feel like you're, because you're making your own money, you feel like it's okay? Or like you're easier yeah, that's like wanting that's to go off more? Yeah, that's yeah. Like that's like why I would like to do yeah. pretty much just yeah. for like social money. Yeah, like if I know I'm going to have like a pretty nice, like if I know I'm going to have like an okay paycheck mm -hmm. coming in, I'll like spend like yeah. a lot of that money before I even get that paycheck because I'm like, oh, I'm going to get paid. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you guys' opinions on like these kinds of discount apps? Discount apps? Do you think that it's cool, that like, more restaurants should offer it, or something that you guys actually use? The restaurants that don't do it are Really big yeah. 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 Like, top yeah. 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 Until, like I think especially as like a journalism nerd, like the way that they marketed it was unbelievable. Like no one knew who they were and then they did the dollar margaritas mm -hmm. and I mean they quickly like overnight became the place to be. Mm -hmm. So I think that specials for students and especially during basketball season mm -hmm. and yeah. football, it's just huge. Yeah. Since, since I have like the front flip out, I like me and my boyfriend go to Jefferson's every Sunday because we we'll, like use the front flip app and usually get like if it's not an appetizer like we'll get yeah. a free dessert or something. So that's like something big for us. It's like we want to go somewhere that we can save money and like mm -hmm. front flip's a big thing. That's yeah. mm -hmm. we decide Especially with those apps like front flip, like if I get a like Jefferson's and I get fifty percent off an app, I wasn't gonna get an app. But because I get fifty percent yeah. off, I'm like, why wouldn't I get an app? Right. Like, I spend That's more. Like, true. I kind of spend more because of apps because like it's that. Because like, it's a deal. Because yeah, it's a deal. <laughs> <laughs> well, and before that, we you weren't considering it all because of the money. But now yeah. it's like, well, it's only four dollars versus eight, so that. Yeah, exactly. So you're like, more willing to spend that yeah, money. Yeah, I think yeah. it's like they're like giving. I mean, it's like a discount, but at the same time, it's like they end up making more money. Yeah, make yeah. more money because of it. Does anyone else agree with that? Or? that's like how there's any sale like you go shopping and like something's on sale you're like well it's on sales half off like mm -hmm. you probably wouldn't have bought any something anyways but if it's half off mm -hmm. you have to buy it i brought you home with four uh, like four bunches of bananas the other day they were 19 cents <laughs> and, and she just wanted one yeah. but she came home with four bunches yeah. i mean i i agree with that like you just see the deal so you yeah take the deal um and so would you guys rather have mm -hmm. one app like front flip where you can use it out five different restaurants or an individual restaurant app. One, 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 app. one app. One app. One app that like a lot of restaurants participate in. Yeah. That, oh, yeah. Okay. And then would you rather have a reward card like where you get fans and things like that or would you rather have an app? I'd rather have an app. Yeah. 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 They only yeah. work for like places you go to like all the time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Remember three spins had mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. 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 I was one punch away. Yeah. I got a new card every time. Yeah, they made you on a punch card. Yeah. yeah. But I prefer the reward card because I didn't really just go to the app to search is there any discount for this uh, restaurant. Okay. So if I have a reward card, every time I go to this restaurant, I would just so maybe I have a reward card. So that's more like front of mind yeah. versus like an app is more fun. Okay. 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 And so how aware are you guys of Fuzzy Taco Shop? Very aware. Very aware. <laughs> Can I ask why you're very aware? Is it because of the food? Is it because of the drinks? Is it because of the atmosphere? A lot of people. Uh, really like it's a combination yeah. with location. Yeah. Yeah. I think a lot of people recommend it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Go out to mass and go to the bars and then. Eat food <laughs> 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 so the hours are definitely important to you guys. Yes. Well, there like wasn't that many places that you could go get food that day. Mm -hmm. Like in Lawrence, it's just like shocking because like there's so many students out. So like, mm -hmm. yeah, this is the place you can, you know, just like order it. Like, sure, you can order food from like pickle at three in the morning, but like, 
can actually go in your pussies. Right. You can sit down and like end yeah. your yeah. night yeah. Yeah. and make your night. Instead of having like sit at a Taco Bell drive through or right. sit like a McDonald's or, and the drive, or like wait you know, the drive for a delivery. Yeah. 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 You know, you just want right. them yeah. by. And so I think it has... <laughs> Also, like Fuzzies and Jefferson's, like again with like a long game day, it's like everyone's mm -hmm. kind of hungover at like eight o'clock. <laughs> you're really hungry, and like not that many places are open, and yeah. you just want like food. Yeah, you know? yeah. 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 No, that's yeah. definitely think true. Fuzzies is, you know, definitely that kind of thing. Would you say your perception of Fuzzies is not necessarily like Chipotle, where like you would go for lunch? It's more like the late night. Mm -hmm. It's much more social. I think it's like a dinner place to me. Unless yeah. it's like you think a dinner? Sunday afternoon. Mm -hmm. Like I don't think yeah. I would go there on a Saturday afternoon, mm -hmm. but I'd go there for like dinner before I went out. I go there for breakfast on Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. They have really? Yeah. 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 They yeah. serve breakfast yeah. all day long. So overall, like it's not just because it's a social atmosphere. Like a lot of restaurants have been open being open. It's but it's not just a great food. So are you yeah. guys saying that it's a great atmosphere and great food? Yeah. It's also very casual. It's kind of like we said earlier. It's like you go and you, you're in line and you pick up your food and you're not bothered for the yeah. rest of the night mm -hmm. by a waitress. Like you're, you're paid for, it's done. Like, mm -hmm. But it still feels more like a yeah, restaurant and you're, than like Chipotle does. Yeah. So yeah. I still feel like you're like in a restaurant and like it's more like you're sit down dining yeah. versus Chipotle mm -hmm. where it still kind of feels like fast food. It's a nice yeah. I feel like even though it's in the same like, food, you know, aspect of Chipotle, mm -hmm. like, it's hard to confuse with Chipotle, because Chipotle is Chipotle, like, it's just, like, <laughs> right. I really, it's yeah. so yeah. hard, yeah. 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 but, like, Fuzzy's also, like, Chipotle offers alcoholic beverages, mm -hmm. but they're very, like, you know, I don't think people are, like, allergic to drink, mm -hmm. so Fuzzy's, like, distinguishes themselves. Yeah. Like, Can you even get Fuzzy's to go? Like, I've never, I don't think I've ever met, like, I don't anyone taking Fuzzy's to go. I don't think so. Go. I'm sure you could pick it up off the train yeah. and take it out, I'm, but... Yeah. Where I feel like your boy is more like yeah. a lot of people get it together. Yeah. Because yeah. 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 you go So you guys are like willing to spend 30 minutes to an hour and a half, and even at 2 o'clock in the morning when you're drunk. Just because it's an option, but also it's because it's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. I would say at theater that Fuzzy's is that the line sometimes can be very like long and take a while. Like it would be, I would choose to go to Salido's over Fuzzy's mm -hmm. sometimes just because.